Hey, so today we're gonna do a short tutorial about rigging, uh, how to rig a simple hand or leg. But I'm gonna use hand for today's video. So first of all, you need to Duke. Uh, doesn't matter which one. I'm sure they're all the same. In Duke, you have different body parts. Yeah, you can create. Uh, we're gonna use simple one arm. Click, it will generate the uh, arm. Uh, just three shapes connected to each other. With the leg and the whole body or spine tail it's a bit more complicated like you see leg one has more details and it's specifically for leg and uh, so i just don't use that so how it works uh you just position them uh where your hand is you can change size if you want they're too big. Okay. Now. You can rig it like normally. You can just attach like this. The whole layer to each part. And this wrist one. The top one. And when you select, you need to select all of these uh, bones. And you go either here or here, out of rig. You click it, it will rig it for you. You can see it's here, but it's kind of like janky. You see, it's like these parts are moving here. It's not solid. It's not realistic enough. You just go back. Undo everything. So how we do it, we attach puppet pins. First, we're going to fix this. So we're making sure that this part doesn't move, right? Just creating these, removing. So we create one here. And on second hand, we make sure we create three here. One, not reaching, but we're gonna create it here. Here. Yeah, let's create it here. So how it works, it basically depends on what, which part you want to be moved and which part you want to be just fixed. So we did the, now what we do is select all those. So you select, you can create bone from puppet pin. Basically it attached puppet pin to a uh, null. No, it's shape letter, but it basically is like a null. So you can control it. With this uh, null, remove this, do the same for everyone. It can get a bit confusing at the beginning. We try to do it with very like simple hand. Let's remove these. We don't need this. Okay. So how we make it? First of all, you attach this one to the orange one which is this one right so we, if we move it it will move with it so uh, with this one second one is a bit more into calculate or think a bit more it's not just attaching so when we move arm uh, this shouldn't move right so basically we're attaching this one to orange so when the hand rotates, this yellow thing rotates, it won't affect this one. So we're attaching this to orange. Pretty much, uh, let's let's try attaching everything except for the last one, the orange. Right. It's uh, rigged. So we can see how it works. Okay, uh, let's turn off these so we... make it smaller uh, icon size yeah as you can see it's uh, yeah not moving that's great the next one is top one we connect to yellow one which is second layer from bottom for forearm and we do that 
So it follows but it bends weirdly. Let's try attaching top one, this one to yellow as well. Yeah, okay, this one makes sense. Yeah, okay. Just try to not open too much. As you can see, yeah, these are following this uh, orange and top one because when it falls, like it falls uh, with the clothes on. Okay, that makes sense. Um, this, these three, I think it's the right one. Yeah, we're attached to yellow because it should rotate with it. Yeah, I will move these three, but not the fourth one because we didn't attach it. We're attaching fourth one to the, I think, hand right, this one, beginning of the green. Yeah, we do uh, this. So this is hand with the umbrella. We're gonna attach into arm. Sorry, not the arm, it's the hand. Like this, pretty much it. Rotate. Let's turn off these. Um, these. And that's pretty much it. You can do that with uh, multiple layers. If you have uh, multiple fingers, you can create multiple arm bones and just attach to each finger. Or you can just uh, do that with, um, let's say, hold the finger, create pocket pins, right? Um, go here, add bones, and you can just work with bones without rigging it. Up to you, you can just connect top one to previous. When you move this, it will follow. Yeah, let me turn this off. You can see. Yeah, you can kind of or you can just rig it like this. Up oh. and scale it down. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Basic, very basic, very simple. It's just uh, um, easy to get confused with uh, so many nulls and controls. But yeah, you just start with simple and uh, keep trying because it's, it's always confusing in the beginning.